Okay, so uh, in this video I'm going to show you how to install uh, Custom Firmware Pro B9 or 6.60 Pro B9 on PSP Go. Um, this works on pretty much any PSP out there. Um, you can, as long as you're on 6.60, or you can also update your Pro Custom Firmware to B9 if you're already on Pro. Uh, if you're on 6.20 and 6.35, I think. Um, I don't know, look it up. But this is based on the PSP Go on official firmware 6.60. So, all right. So what you need is basically if your PSP is already updated to 6.60, then all you gotta do is plug in your PSP to your computer or your SD card, and it will download this folder. Uh, the link will be on the description. So uh, once you have your PSP plugged in, open it up. Open up the PSP folder, open up the game folder, and now open up the Pro B folder. Okay, there's two folders in there. And basically, all you gotta do is drag these into the PSP. Okay, both of the folders. Alright, so once you have that done, you're pretty much done. Uh, now all you basically have to do is go on your PSP, go to, uh, to the game section, and you'll see a pro update. Hit X, run it. It's going to detect your firmware and everything, and it's going to install it, and you're set to go. And now the fast recovery folder there, you need to have it because uh, this firmware, uh, every time you turn off your PSP completely off, um, it goes back to official firmware, so you need that fast recovery to go back to custom firmware real quick. Uh, so uh, don't forget that folder because you need it. All right. So basically, once you have this, you're done. Uh, other people have been asking me, "Hey, where do you put your ISO backups or whatever?" And basically, when you uh, open up your PSP uh, DSD card or you plug it in, this on the root of the memory card just create a new folder uh, with you know ISO all capital and basically just drag your ISO uh, backups on here and that's it you're good to go alright so I'm gonna show you guys how the process goes on the PSP go here alright so here we go uh, make sure you're on uh, custom firmware I mean uh, official firmware 6.60 like that Make sure you copy all the files. Once you have all the files copied, go to games and you'll see there Pro Update. That's what you want. So go ahead and uh, just hit X. Okay, run it. So you'll get this. Uh, it says press X to launch custom firmware, press triangle to uninstall custom firmware, or hold L to reinstall custom firmware, and press R to exit. So, what you want to do is you want to press X and it's going to say press X to start custom firmware. Okay, so now if you go to settings, system information, there you go, 6.60 Pro B9, and you're now on custom firmware. Now you can launch your ISO backups. Oops. Just fine. And once you're on custom firmware, you can delete the Pro Update folder, or yeah, you can delete it. You won't need it anymore unless you want to uninstall it. Then you'll have to keep it there and then 
and install it. And that's basically it. You have all your games there. And there's a fast recovery to use uh, whenever you shut down your PSP completely off. This is what you need to uh, run the firmware once again. So that's it.